Hi guys, what's up? I'm back with the boys, season one, episode four. This episode, I think, just because of the title, intrigues me the most. It's called The Female of the Species. So I'm ready to figure out who that is. Last episode, we got introduced to Mother's Milk, who's a really uh, cool character to be introduced to. I also like how we got some Starlight and Huey moments. And we also figure out that Compound V is some kind of drug for soups out there, and it kind of makes them crazy and kill people. Um, anyways, I'm excited to see what this episode has in store for us, so let's get started. Oh, the young butch. <laughs> They're the best band. Oh, come off it. <laughs> the lion's still, if you really want to go play a front row. He's different. Seat, seat, They're different. I don't want to. Do I? Yeah. So you get to figure out what happens and why they stop being a group. Something happens to someone. Where's the dog go now? She knows the camera is there that he's looking at her. Susan, I am shocked and saddened by that. <laughs> really? I'm sure. I don't Speaking think anybody trusts you. I haven't seen Translucent around anywhere. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? You think suits are cunts now. You just wait till they're wearing camera. I mean, what's to stop Sergeant Homelander? Yeah, they seem like the worst out. people to be in the military, right? Homelander obviously enjoys killing. Like, I can't even imagine you giving in that power. Violence. But if you fuck me on this, for the rest of your life, you'd be drinking your own piss at a black site. Say you understand. She is an intimidating man. See, now, Susan, this is why I never went anywhere with us. You can't have two alpha males, because inevitably someone's... Say you fucking understand. <laughs> I understand. Yeah. Not to mention, his girl was shacking up with some other dude. We and they were free to explore. Explore what? Gonorrhea? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, French. Why work so motherfucking hard if you don't have somebody to go home to and sleep next to at night? Well, I go to sleep oh, next to someone Huey. different. Yeah. Why is Huey in this mission? Does he even know how to use a gun? Let's go. I'm a grown looking woman. God damn it, Frenchie. Let's leave the door open, right? Oh, that's the woman? Is that the woman? Is that the, the, the female or whatever? Yeah, yeah, they call her the female. Thank God, like, I love Prime because you can just see the x ray and see what characters' names are and all that. That's the female. I'm excited. I'm excited. Okay. I'm gonna rewind knowing that now. God, he'd rather kill himself than let her have his, her hands on him. <laughs> this is therapist. Maybe I was just drunk, but I don't care, bro. You talk to the guys. No bell. Dolphins. In Japan, did they hunt down and slaughter twenty thousand dolphins a year? <laughs> Intelligent animals. It's a they conversation killer, though. Depending on the people. Frenchie is definitely like interested in uh, the female. I had a feeling about her. Nah, Frenchie, you just didn't follow the plan. You never follow the plan, man. Man, yeah, like from what my view as well, she was locked in there, probably not by will. So he he had good intentions. Come on. Cool of it right now. You're fucking going. As a rule, I don't usually go out after a 
gory massacre. Listen, as a rule, a you're gonna hop my good phone from now on. We hear everything she says. And this is a golden opportunity. It's not no, fair. You She's not a bad person. She's a soup, Huey. Okay, this is where we need to draw the line, Butcher. Because there are good soups too. Okay. I think that what Vought has done is give them too much power to do whatever they want and that's what kind of corrupts them. And also giving a psycho like Homelander that power is dangerous, you know? But she grew up wanting to help people. Yep, as we speak. But you can get there quicker. Can I please have the room? Does that mean he has to like lift her fly? Middle of the Atlantic. Yep. No man's land. As soon as I can. Promise. Promise. Oh. Don't make me use that gas on you. Huh? You don't want to fuck with Cherry, man. Yeah. Listen, I'd just like to, you know, maybe do something with a little more substance. Okay. Yeah? I hear you. Yes. Okay. Uh huh. Deep. Play to your strengths. What does that even mean? <coughs> Play to use strengths. Do you remember when you relapsed? I stayed and I rubbed your back. Clean up your puke. I'm there for you always. So she's an addict? And yet you use her to get your compound V stuff and don't expect her to take it as well? I don't know. I love you too. I don't trust him. So, oh, she needs a manicure and pedicure for sure. Money, Teddy, special deal. Some revenge going on there. Alright, let's see what you got. Bowling? Man, she gotta whoop you. Really? You said you, uh, you bowled before? Yeah, I'm just a little rusty. You? Uh, yeah, here. Actually. She's oh, wrestling? I... Yeah, I had a very Jesus centric childhood. <laughs> Oh, PTSD. PTSD. That scared me a little bit, but like the loud noise. You never ask me out again. What were you saying? No, just about prom. Oh. What was it? What about your? Nothing. You're spacing it's out. Stupid. So what's uh, what the translucent like? That's a conversational left turn. Yes, it was. I'm sorry about that. Sorry, yeah, it just popped into my head as a kid. You're blowing it so hard now, like. The reason she wants to hang with you is because you treat her like a normal per person, and now like you see him like her, ignoring her, and then you're asking about her hero friend. He spends most of his free time with his son. Yeah, this son. Where's one more person, wasn't there? Oh, easy, fella. Take it easy. There you go, just relax. God damn you, this would fucking happen. Now you messed up the oh, controls. He doesn't care. He's so useless. You can just Superman it, like, kind of guy the plane and landed. Like, he's like that complete opposite of Superman. It's kind of interesting because he has the same ability to see through things, laser sight, flying, and yet he uses all of these things to actually hurt people. Superman would never, even if it's like an enemy, he he wouldn't do that. Like laser sight someone that's too intense. Fly at it, ram it straight. Oh, that kind of 
kind of speed, you know, Kamingo's ass over Ted, or I'll punch straight through the hull. This guy. This guy. Maybe, maybe. See, okay, now we're seeing a shift in her where she's like, we can't just let these people die like this. It's one thing when he's killing, like, the enemy that the guy who was shooting up the place or these um, plane hijackers, but plane full of innocent people. I don't think she could leave them. She might end up doing it, I don't know, but, like, look at that face. Fine, guys. Everything's fine. She begs You're him. Okay. She's like, please. Wait, you're leaving us? No, 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 no. I'm just uh, seeing something down the back. Maybe. He is a psychopath. He doesn't care. But what she, can she do? She can't even fly. This is not cool, man. You gotta save the only them? Man, how do you choose? Women and children? No, man. No, you stay back. All of you, stay back. You stay the fuck back and I'll laser you, goddammit. I'll laser every fucking one of you. You can't save any of them now. You fucked it. Like, seriously, like, ruin your entire reputation here. I may save any of them. No, that doesn't work. Let's go. All of them have to die now, and I hate this. She's quite selfish, so she might just leave him. This is some fucking terrible bullshit. He messed it up in the first place by totally ruining the control panel because he can't control his laser sight. You didn't need to laser sight him. And then you didn't even try lifting the plane or anything like that. Like, didn't even try. <sighs> I'm just so good. Okay, they never restocked it for however long she's been gone. Oh, that's what that was. Just trying to get home. I'm Ezekiel, and I want you to join me at the Believe Expo. June the Believe Expo. Sponsored by Samaritan's Embrace. We're gonna have music, we're gonna have worship, food trucks. That's what she grew up with? You okay? No, yeah. he's not yes. okay. Yeah. No. You seem a little weird. I don't know. Different. He probably thinks it's because he knows she's Star, Starlight. Why are they so bad? You say you bowled a lot and, you know, you have, like, superpowers, yet you are a remarkably shitty bowler. He's hustling, man. You know what I think's happening? I think you're holding back for some weird, not gonna show me up on a first date reason. You want to quit stroking my ego and show me what you really got? I like that. I like that. Yeah, there's no way she'd be bad. Come on. <laughs> Sweet. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. Now that's a strike. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what the fuck's that Jesus thumping elastic bastard going through with it? We find the girl, we find out. It's all connected, what we saw on the TV yeah. and this. Alright, platform. It seems to really just understand how people or super special people work and things and that. When I was a boy, my father used to me from Mama. Stole you? In Marseille, middle of the night, just broke into me. 
Smokey good wash, tell me you love me. Then... Oh, shit. I tried to run away so many times. He relates to her. But you're gonna mess it up. It didn't seem right, though. You went off plan because it didn't seem I'm right. I'm sorry, okay? It, well, it didn't seem right, either. She seems uh, scared. Sean and she's jumpy, you know? Then all of a sudden, this senior shoved Sean, and then he hit him. So I step in. I kick the guy's ass. Where are you? Mm. Want to know how Sean thanked me? No. He never spoke to me again. Not one word. Fucking mm. loser. And that's when I learned. Never show your strengths to a boy you like. Well, to be honest, Sean Jakowski had a tiny little baby dick. <laughs> <laughs> Does it bother you that I could whip your ass in bowling and in everything and bench press you? Oh my god, is that a threat or a promise? Yeah. <laughs> Both? No, no, I, I catch him. Hmm? Oh. What? Take it off for her. Something like that. Doesn't work for you? No. <laughs> what? Oh. Save my spot. I'll be right back. Robin's gone. But I understand how it seems like a betrayal, like a soup killed her. And now he's on a date with one, you know? Oh, you win. Oh yeah, how deep up your ass did you pull that? It depends, how deep does your tongue go? Listen, you lost her, man. We had orders. Help me understand, Frenchie. What happened the night that Mallory had your tail lamp light? Oh, yes, enough. Mallory was our boss, man. Mallory was- We had orders. Your boss? You were supposed to follow him. You were supposed to follow Lamplighter, tell him, but you let him go. I didn't know. And Lamplighter goes and torches Mallory's grandkids. I didn't know. It doesn't matter. Lamplighter? He's the dude that retired in that Starlight place, right? Sporty fucking Spice. What's she up to? Sporty Spice? I don't know. Exactly. How about Posh? You know what she's doing? I don't understand. No idea. Wait. Ginger, on the other hand, has released three albums. Passion, Schizophonic, and Scream if you want to go faster. Why, why is he talking about the Spice Girls right now? They'll all make your ears bleed. What's your point? You see, when they're apart, they're absolute fucking rubbish. When they're but together? You put them together. Oh, God, they're fucking Spice Girls. That's very moving. I'm gonna cry. How do you know so much about the Spice Girls? The point is <laughs> that we're all shy by ourselves. We need each other. The fly. We need each other to get the fuck out of here. Can't believe that speech worked. I feel like, are they more confused? Or? Jesus, he gives the worst pep talks. <laughs> he really does. He's still a dolphin? Okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, let's just focus on the escape first and, uh, you know, we can talk about that some other time. What does that mean? I like you too. You know that. Let's not, you know, rush into anything too fast. Okay, okay. If I just touch it, will you shut up? <laughs> oh, jeez. She can't be caught by the police. That means you promise. Bad prop. These are the worst superheroes I've ever freaking seen. Oh, no. Up, man, this guy is useless as hell. I thought the fly we saw would have some use, but nope, he was just there. And like, he probably stinks. The flies will lead them to her. 
Nope, the doors is running. A train. Can she fuck him up, please? Oh, whoa! Whoa, man! Banger at it, man. How many times? Oh, nice job, Frenchie. Hey, she's okay. Sure, absolutely. I can take mine too. Oh gosh. See, that's a good weapon. I like that French. She did that. Don't be fucking stupid. What if she's a spice girl? What if she's a spice girl? I mean, she joined the team, right? It should be valuable. What if she's a spice girl? Are you just calling yourself a spice girl right now? I bet you all have like a list of who's scary spice, who's baby spice, all that. I need to know. In this group. She'd be scary spice, man. She's scary. She ain't no spice girl. You don't know anything about her. Maybe are you gonna step up and do something now? Lander is the worst. He can't even fake cry. God damn it. God bless you. God bless America. We hear you, Homelander! And I hear you, brother! Uh, I hear you! He's playing off and the world so much. Hears you. And very, very soon, my friend, whoever did this to us will hear from all of us! Oh no, that's it? Ooh, that was another good episode, you know? I feel like it's building up to something. I know you guys said that I'm not ready, and uh, we'll see how ready I am. Uh, I thought that the female was a cool addition. We don't know anything about her yet, but she she's um, she's got some powers, you know? And obviously something happened to her where she was taken against her will and just wants to go home, and I like how friends she could relate to that. His story was really, really sad. And he kept crying, kept crying to get to her and get her to calm down all the way to the end until they both were knocked out. So that was sweet of him. A-Train is just doing anything to cover his tracks now. Like seeing him bash her head so fast against the wall, that was, that was kind of messed up. But honestly, each episode I see how crazy Homelander truly is. He is a legit psychopath. He has no feelings. He has no emotions. He's just playing off other people just to hype himself up you know he just doesn't value any human life or anything like that at all and Maeve she she didn't care about any of the bad guys but a plane full of innocent people a child and mother she she didn't want to leave them behind you know she was like we have to try something or at least take the mom and kid but nope couldn't do that that was just all kinds of messed up and I hope that Maeve will stand up someday. I don't know, otherwise you're gonna be taken down along with Homelander, you know? Cause she knows it's wrong. She's not pure evil. She just doesn't have the guts to stand up to him or... I can- I could definitely see a conflict with Huey this episode. He's suffering from some legit PTSD, both from his girlfriend dying in such a horrific way, but also causing Translucent to blow up, especially after finding out he has a son. So he feels bad for kind of playing Starlight, you know, spying on her, trying to ask her about Translucent and all that. But then he saw Robin and it reminded him that by actually liking her, dating her, it kind of betrays her, or that's his his opinion, you know, I think she's, she's a good girl. She just wants someone to see her and you could see that she was really enjoying this date. She didn't have to lower herself or make herself seem less powerful or skilled just to make a man feel better. She doesn't have to do that with Hugh and I think that's great and it's gonna break her heart I think when he, she realizes that he's been spying on her. 
And yeah, we're halfway through the season. I'm excited to see what's left in the second half. I hope you liked my reaction to this. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.